All right, good morning. We're going to jump into the PGA Tour career mode for PGA Tour 2K21. We are on, we're playing the Oceans of Memories. Nice. I don't really remember this course too much, but we are on week number eight. It's going to be a two round event. We won the Juno Cup last week by four. This one I think we won by a whole bunch. Alright, so yeah, week number eight. And yeah, we'll start this off. So if you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Appreciate having you. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. It's a pleasure to bring you our pitch yeah, into action. You feel inclined to do so. Today's coverage of the All right, so tight fairway, downhill. Let's see what we got this I'm morning. The wave of emotions that flow through me on this opening hole, an ocean of memories, a par four, 445 yards. It's a glorious opening tee shot. You want to hug the left-hand side and then embrace the second. It's such a lovely setting, a gorgeous, a magnificent, memorable opening hole here at Ocean of Memories. Let's get down to the action. Well, this one's right at the pin. <clears throat> a wonderful shot and a chance for Booty here on the first. Oh, what a stroke. Ooh. Opportunity to make their par. All right, starting off with a par. I got my tea this morning. Don't have coffee just yet. We have a par five here. Time to take advantage. Good looking shot, this. Staying in the Let's fairway. Down the fairways, John. What's up, mate? Down here on the tenth hole, Tony Finau's prepping his next shot. Playing their fourth shot. This shot from around 210 yards. Looks like they've got the five. All right, pretty good line. I think it might be just a. Touch long. But oh, that's great. It just missed the hole. Playing that like this a par four. The power game in pure fashion there. Two big hits there, knocking it on this par five and two. This one's looking good. All right. Well played. What an eagle. And this one is moving up on the leaderboard after that hole. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. Teeing off here at the third hole. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Too much. Oh, got unlucky there. Second shot here on <clears> the third. <throat> All right, clipped a little rock, but I think we're good there. This be a great up and down from this spot. Definitely enough to make a par. And with that, you can go and put a par on the card. All right, so you can get into a little danger if you go along on that hole. Time to recap note. Bryson DeChambeau's effort from just a little while ago. Third shot now. Oh, that's the shot. Go ahead and make one. Don't worry about getting it up and down. And after that effort, this is how the field is shaping up. Let's see what happens here on the fourth.
and choosing the eight iron yeah. here. Oh, this player's dialed in. What a shot. This puck coming up is for Birdie. Oh, just didn't okay, break on us. Now. Pretty good chance here. This was for fun. Alright, disappointing well, par putt. After a nice tee shot. Gonna miss the fairway unless we get a severe jump right there. Nice. Nicely done. This shot from 120 yards. Going with the pitching wedge here. Come on, look after us. Little bounce to the right here. Alright, pin high, not too bad. Just didn't play the slope of the fairway, I think. This putt will move them to three under par. Don't know if I hit it. Didn't have the line anyway, so. You'll make it the next time. So after that hole, this is what the leaderboard looks like. John, give us a small update. We're just down on the 13th hole now, guys. 20 feet out. Just getting ready for his next shot. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. And after that hole, leaving... Oh, nice. We got Bubba Watson stroke. following us. Let's see what happens here on the 6th. Just a pitch shot here. See if we can get that to Chips bite. The green here. Going up the hill. Oh, that's beautifully judged. Good chance this one. Right on six feet. Not a bad line. Alright, there we go. And he just keeps that was a nice hole. I like that one. Hole. And that will take him to three under. And this effort by Justin Thomas. And with that hole behind us, let's have a look at the contenders and the pretenders. We have a par four on this one. Nice burn in the last hole for a change. First one of the day. They needed it desperately. Now, mm. next hole, looking for more. Hitting it a little That's slow. The rough for mine. Well, I know that we're in the booth and not right up close to it, but it doesn't take a smart person to work out. That's not a nice lie. Going with the 9-iron, I think. But decent look at the flag. Yeah, and it's short back. enough to make it up there. Well, Rich, think they can make this one? Look, i got to say, I'm really not liking their chances here, but you never know. Stranger things have happened. A wonderful part. You can claim it. Back-to-back -back birdies. I like it. Two in a row. Let's see what happens here at the 8th. Luke, this player coming off a birdie on the last hole, getting some momentum going their direction. I don't know why That's I aimed so far to the left. To the left. Probably would have been good if I didn't. Not sure if that's what they're intending to do. Needed to take a little less club on that approach. All right, and what we're gonna do here is just get that up on the green and have it trickle down. And he needs this to save par. Hang on, this looks pretty handy. Well, that's a momentum maintainer. Well done. Let's head over to the ninth. Even for the day, tied for fifth. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. Here we find ourselves on the turn of par four. All 
Alright, starting off pretty good, parting it down the middle. Gonna get a slight kick to the right off of this fairway lie. I wasn't expecting that much, and I wasn't expecting the That's elevation to play that much of a factor. Short with that effort. But these are pretty easy chip shot. Ooh. Those are usually as good of a chance as going in as a putt. Like a decent long putt. So starting off the front nine at four or under. Let's see what happens here at the tenth hole. Excellent opportunity to extend that lead. Mm. What are they gonna do? We got a par five with some tree trouble. I think with the elevation change, the three wood hook should be good enough to play. Oh, it never, I forgot, I changed clubs, so I never hooked it. But that's all right, that works. And this effort by Justin Thomas from the sand, looking to get up and down. Oh, that's incredible, and for birdie two. Oh, trying to hit a little pop <coughs> shot, and they do to perfection. What a shot indeed. Sitting at four under for the day, currently in the lead. Opting for the three wood. Oh, beautiful shot. <clears throat> Sitting up from the first cut here in the green. I can hold it from here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Straight out of the top drawer. Yes. Very smooth tempo there on that chip. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard. After that, this hole is a par three. Choosing the nine iron here. All right, added a little backspin. Oh, this find the surface. Good shot, this. <clears throat> well played. This one for back-to-back -back birdies. Just didn't draw. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. There's been some great play all over this course. How about this shot at the 12th? Here's our leader giving us another reason why they're on top. Lining up for his third now. Our leader is up by four shots now. This hole's a tough two-shotter, a long par four. And we're gonna choke up on the driver to try to get every little bit of yardage that we have without running out of fairway. Nice. All right. Couldn't get any closer than that. Going to play the 37 feet up in the elevation. I think we're going to add a little loft, a little backspin. Oops, sorry about that. Go with the hybrid. <clears throat> See if we can get this thing to land soft. shot that. John, uh, how long is this putt? It seems to be a fair way. From here he's looking at about 22 feet to the cup. Alright, nice putt, playing the break. Well, that should limit the damage. <coughs> Nicely done. And that will take him to six under. He sits in first position. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. All right, 69 feet downhill. I think we can take on that bunker, fly over it. Oh, 
no. Not making the second one. It's a chance for a good shot here from the fairway bunker. Alright, I think we can do the three wood. Should at least be in the fairway. It's a good distance on that one. And here we are with the third shot. Alright, green's running away from us a little bit, so we're gonna try to leave some room for some roll. Especially sharp today, Luke. Very impressive. Looks good off the blade. Mm. Oh, that's frustrating. Just and missing it on the low the side, hole. but we got to tap in par. And after that hole, this is how the leaderboard looks. Currently six under for the event. It's time to tee off here at the 14th hole. Oh, that sounded absolutely flushed. And let's take a look at this shot from moments ago. Justin Thomas with an amazing shot. This is his third. Let's return to live play now. Opting for the 9-9. Swinging the groove. Dare I say, Luke, this player has been in fuego with his approach. Just mm, missing that one on the low side, too. A bit low on that one. Just three feet to the cup. Ooh, nice line. Nicely hold. And for power. Currently six under for the round. But, yeah, six under so far. Let's still see nothing what happens there. Here on the 50. And after that par, we're looking for something good here. Alright, it's going to be a super tight fairway down there. We're probably going to run out of fairway, I think, but it's a short par 4. Oh, let's see if we can get on the green. I think that's actually one of the challenges for the sponsorship. So, it was close. Now I guess we got two opportunities to do that. The 15th and I think it was the second where we hit the driver and got into a little bit of trouble, overshot the green. Or no, not the second, maybe the third. Still in the lead now after that hole. Pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. What kind of rhythm is that? It must be tough falling out of bed every day with a rhythm like that. All right, well placed trees Second blocking the green. On the I remember this hole. We're going to try to thread the needle there. Uh, it's a brave one. Driver off the deck. Well, this should be unpredictable. Don't know what you're going to get from the golfing gods here. Getting ready to play their third. to the cup coming up it's tracking wow <laughs> that's classy good sign from there not a way to grind it out in the bunker but up and down for the birdie nicely done john you're down there what's happening well guys i'm over here taking a look at bryson DeChambeau's game he's over here on the 17th and this for the birdie our leader is up by a whopping six shots now. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. 
You're a great swing there. All right, just kind of try playing the center of the green, knowing that the elevation it was going to wind up in the back, but wasn't hoping that far back. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. What a shame. Has hit a lot of greens today, just not on this occasion. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. Yeah, nothing to sweat over that one. We'll hold. And this effort by Justin Thomas. A putt for the lead. Who wouldn't want that? And after that effort, let's take a look at how it stands. Our current leader is enjoying a six-stroke advantage. Well, let's come down to this, the final hole. Welcome to the 18. All right, a little 84, 85 well, percent. Here, it should find the fairway. Driver. Up from around 160 yards. We're gonna loft that one up in the air a little bit more, see if we can get it to land softly. Good shot there. Well, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. Alright, that to go at 9 under 4. Well, there you have it, Rich, at the end of the opening round. He finds himself in first place. Yes, you always want to be in first place. Alright, so thanks for tuning round. in. We'll do Stay round two in just a minute. I'm going to get a little bit of work done this morning. We'll see how this but we will get this right one started up on the editing well, and see you on round two. So. On behalf of Rich B, plus all the hard working folks at HB Studios, it's good night.